Okay, welcome back to Planet Crafter. I, I just launched a couple rockets, uh, a biomass, and then uh, one that's going to pull in the uh, uranium. But I was thinking, I wonder if we can get on a rocket, like if we jump on top of it, how high would it take us into the atmosphere? Oh, here comes our uranium. Oh, that looks like it's coming right at us. how high we can get. So let's get let's get a rocket. Let's see if we can get up there just standing here. We gotta kind of uh, perfect it before we try. Okay we are on the side of it. we can't, unless we can get on the rim like this, I don't know how high it'll take us up. We can try it. Shoot. Yeah. Shoot. I was hoping I could get onto it, but it didn't quite work. Now, if you need super alloy, you're going to fly down. All the way down there, there's a cave at the very end where you can get super alloy, but you have to have a tier two extractor. The tier 1 will just get you the basic minerals. Most of my resources I have marked on the map, but this one I do not. Uh, there's this cave right here. You can see the where the ship is to it. Fly in here. I have my extractor over here. As you can see, I've been emptying it, but you want to empty it completely because if you don't, you get stuck with a whole bunch of other minerals that you can easily get. What I usually do is grab a super aluminum, and then I can take take the the basic stuff that you don't need and just kind of drop it all. Head down this way back towards our base with 
these, this is the red mineral, you can actually get this in a tier 1 extractor or a tier 2. I prefer the tier 2s because you get a lot better storage capacity. You go up here. You know, you can get all the red mineral. And as you can see, even the tier 1 has the Red Mirror Island also. I'm not going to gather all of it right now. I just want to empty it. If you come over this way. Oh, here we have another one of those white crystals. If you come over here, this is the sulfur fields. And this you can use a tier 1. And you'll get sulfur from these. You can also find it laying around. On the ground here. As you can see. Okay, now let's head back towards the base. There's some of the red kind of scattered out around the cave also. Here's some of our uranium that came down with the asteroid. Should be more of it around here somewhere. Because I know one of them hit up here. Yep, here it is. If you don't want to bring down an asteroid for it, I will show you. As soon as I empty my inventory of the other two, I will take you over and show you where to find places to put the extractors for getting your uranium in a cave. If we go this way, we're going to go over towards this, these look like aluminum spires. You can set up tier 1 extractors here to get your aluminum. kind of grab some oxygen and come right down here and you're gonna there's gonna be a case that's got some stuff in it there's no, it's not real I'm gonna leave that case there but I put you can put up markers helps you find these if you come in here you put a tier 2 and you get uranium in that one but it does have to be a tier 2 so and then I'm just going to come out here and drop any of the stuff that is easy to find. Because you can just set up a tier 1 extractor really anywhere on the map to get this standard stuff. Okay, now if you keep coming along here. Follow these rock formations. 
stations. There's another spot up here that's kind of a point of interest. As you can see, I have it marked right now. There are a couple of ways to get to this one also. This one, you're going to come across this. There's a bunch of uh, cases in some of these pods. Oh, actually, I'm going to take that stuff with me because these will be beneficial too. I've got myself another little base set up here for oxygen. And then if you go down here, there is a lot of rooms down there. I'll let you explore that. Um, it's There's a lot of ladders going up and down and there's a ton of really cool stuff in there. Okay, from here, this will kind of give you the up other direction you can come from. You come along, kind of watch the rock formations that you're seeing on my screen. You're going to come across the cave entrance right here. Come in here. In this one, you're going to need to have a tier two. Always like to have another one. This one, I've got a lot of uh, aluminum stored up because I had gone out one time. This one has that blue osmium. That's another one of those rare minerals that you can actually gather with an extractor now. But unfortunately, you do have to have a tier 2 extractor for all of these. And that pretty much gets you all the, the minerals you're going to need. The That white crystal, there's quite a few around. You have to kind of look for those up, outcroppings with the root you'll find those. There's quite a few. Just kind of keep your eyes open as you fly around. And then we have our... Oh, you're going to need quite a bit of algae. So you can get your algae fields set up. And there we go. Okay, well that shows you where everything's at. So you know where to set up your your extractors. It'll help you gather a lot of resources to build a nice big base. So thank you so much for watching. I do really appreciate it. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Please remember to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button also. I would really appreciate it. Comment down below what you think. If you have any other questions or if you have any like uh, comments or uh recommendation or anything like that make sure you let me know down in the comments thank you so much you have a great rest of your day and i will talk to you soon well thank you so much for stopping by and watching one of my videos if you're new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so you know exactly when the next video comes out i do offer a wide range of different kinds of videos so check out the playlists and you might find something else that you like other than this kind of video you watched today. Thank you so much. Comment down below what you thought or just say hi. Have a great rest of your day.